Hello. Um, yes, I am going to say it. My hair is a mess. I have not been doing much today but paperwork and figuring out when I'm going to work. I do have four promos. Um, liquor, some I've already done, so I will be doing reviews on those. And then also for vodka, I have not previewed yet. And I may be doing sangria. Not sure if I'm going to be doing that or not until the following weekend or so. But today, my question on my channel, I haven't really been able to have long videos or really get in depth with everything because I did start a um, teaching job, an instructor job, instructing. I cannot find a good position for this. But I did start instructing um, adult education. They still have me there with my office and extension number and I'm still an adjunct professor or instructor but just a substitute status because the enrollment slow they had to drop some classes and they had and mine was one of them and I'm one of the newbies and come to find out it's someone that's worked there 30 years that they had to move in there so that's been kind of a blow so I've been trying to set up more work for now and starting my own business eventually I just want to be able to have this stuff with my family over with. And that's basically why I am talking today. I am drinking a little bit of that wine that I had left over from yesterday. If you haven't checked that out, that's the Red Blend, the uh, flatbed review. To me, it seems better the next day. And I know I can't keep it open for too long, so... I'm going to need to drink it here and there. But my question is, what do you consider lazy? I'd like to know why people consider it lazy or consider one lazy that has like three or four different jobs that they're pursuing and doing. Yeah, they might all be part-time. They might be periodically. But it's... So, the person's able to clean, cook, and do all the chores and the bill paying and the grocery shopping and all those things that are actually jobs now, you know. People get hired for. But I get told by my mother today that I'm lazy. And I was like, seriously, when I've had this house for going on 20 years, I've got three degrees. I've worked at one of my jobs for seven years, the other one for about 11, and the other one for about 10. And I'm constantly doing two to four different kind of jobs, which mainly it's two to three, but it's getting to be old. I don't feel like I have any time to myself. I cannot get it through my parents' head that I don't owe them money. It's a long story. You'd have to watch my other videos. But basically, they chose to have my older daughter down there because we only live like three or four houses apart on the same road. And they did it to help me with working and going to school, which I did. And now they're trying to make it into the situation that did not even happen. And they're trying to call me lazy. But my 42-year-old brother, almost 42-year-old brother, lives down there and does not work or pay his child support, does not drive, but I'm lazy. It's like these people are toxic. I'm having to let them go. But that is not lazy. Lazy is having and doing nothing in life. I'm sorry, but that's considered lazy. I'm tired. I'm exhausted emotionally and physically. That's why I've not been on my channel as much. Also, in between these jobs that I have, and it's so disheartening because I wanted to basically just have one main job. I was going to still keep like a little bit of tutoring maybe here and there and definitely my promos and mainly just teach at the college for adult education. And then that got knocked down last week. It's like one blow after another. I'm tired of hearing everybody's crap. I want to have time to think. I want to have time to have peace in my life, and I want to be 
at one and not called these names and not told every day how bad I am. And it just will not stop. It's like there's people that have good intentions and they want to start businesses and I do too, but I want all this off of me before I even do that. And there's other things that I just want to clear and get done with and people want to down me for that. So my question is what entitles, what do you consider lazy? Because I sure do not consider myself lazy. I kept this house in the midst of 9-11, the recession, all the foreclosures going on, being a single mom with two children, going to school while I had one in diapers, that was to finish up my bachelor's, and there's no gratitude, and I'm still called lazy. I am here to tell you, if you have these same kind of problems, don't let someone bring you down. Don't let people bring you down because no means, by no means, is surviving, going to school, having a whole bunch of ways and incomes, lazy. And I'm done with it. I'm over it. 